Today, let's popularize the working principle of the sodium hypochlorite generator. This is a miniature structure diagram. From left to right, tap water is first softened in the soft water tank, and then mixed with the brine produced by the molten salt tank in proportion to a metering pump and sent to the electrolytic cell. In the electrolytic cell, dilute brine is electrolyzed to produce sodium hypochlorite and hydrogen gas. The generated sodium hypochlorite flows into the storage tank and is then transported to the water treatment system by the dosing pump. Meanwhile, the hydrogen exhaust fan discharges the hydrogen. The core electrolytic cell adopts a transparent shell, which is convenient for observing the operating startups. The anode is titanium electrolyte to extend its service life. The electrolytic reaction is as follows. Sodium chloride reacts with water to produce chlorine gas, hydrogen gas, and sodium hydroxide. Sodium hydroxide then reacts with chlorine gas, and eventually sodium hypochlorite is produced. Compared with microstructures, medium-sized systems have a higher degree of automation and stronger stability. This technology is also widely applied in fields such as circuit board printing and electroplating of hardware.